specificity function of an infinitesimally small thin wire lying in the x-axis. Uh, and the density function is uh, given by x, uh, density function at x is uh, x times the natural log of x. And we're asked to find the mass of the wire lying on the interval between x equals 3 and x equals 9. So the formula for mass is um, of an uh, infinitesimally thin wire, given the linear density of the wire, is pretty easy. It's just the integral um, over the interval, so 3 to 9, of the density function uh, with respect to x. So mass is just the integral from 3 to 9 of x times the natural log of x. Uh, dx, and this just becomes an exercise in uh, integration by parts. So if we let u equal natural log of x, then du is 1 over x times dx. Uh, and then we have dv equal to x dx, and v, if we just integrate this, we get uh, 1 half x squared. So mass is equal to uh, uv, which is 1 half x squared times the natural log of x, uh, evaluated from 3 to 9, uh, minus the integral of v du. So we pull the 1 half outside the integral sign. We're left with x squared times 1 over x dx. And of course that integral is still over 3, uh, over the interval 3 to 9. So now we compute this integral and we get negative uh, 1 over 6 uh, times x cubed evaluated from 3 to 9. Or excuse me, no. Um, what am I doing? I forgot to cancel the integrand and the last, um, the last quality. So x cancels out the, x, or one x term in the numerator is canceled out by x in the denominator. So this is uh, just the integral of x. So this becomes minus 1 fourth x squared evaluated from 3 to 9. And if you work all this out, you'll find that it's approximately equal to 66.0438.